What's going on, everybody? See here, and welcome back to some more Slime Rage 2. So, last episode, we got Bob. We got some unlocks and we got some upgrades. And today, what we're going to do is we're going to focus on the ranch. We're going to focus on the observatory, our place, our place that we call home. And we're going to work on getting our slimes organized up here. We got to get we got to get things done a little bit better here. So, I have been slacking, not doing a good job. And that is just not okay. So, what I want to do here is basically kind of like a reorganizational thing. Um, I want to go through all of our slimes that we have, make sure we have all the slimes. We don't have pink slimes right now. I know we don't have pink slimes, so I know we're going to have to get, go get some pink slimes. Uh, make sure we have all of the slimes. Everybody's combined, doing the things, doing the stuff, and that we have a good food source and that everything's fully upgraded. So that way we're ready to make some mass quantities of anything or do whatever we need to do. So, um, yeah, thanks again for coming out. Hopefully you guys enjoy. If you do, like, subscribe, all the fun things, and let's get into it. So... The first couple of slimes is we've got our um, our bunny slimes. So we've got the the bunny what the bunny tabbies over there, and they like this melon. So what I'm thinking is our basic type of things are going to go in this area. Now, what I want to do is I actually want to suck up all these chickens. <laughs> There's going to be so many chickens. All right, so I want to suck up these chickens, and I'm actually going to go ahead and move. Um, I want to move these guys into there. And the reason for that is because we can put their food source right next to them. Actually, why don't I just do this instead? Instead of moving these guys over there and moving their food source right next to them, why don't I move these guys over here because their food source is already right there. You know what I'm saying? Like, might as well. Let's make this simple. You know what? Actually, I kind of want to look at something here. Maybe we'll do this a little bit differently. What is the most valuable plort that we have? Fire plorts are worth quite a bit. I don't know. I want to know what the most valuable plort is at its bottom. It all like they're probably about the same. Okay, never mind then. <laughs> we'll just continue as we were. Uh, never mind. As I was, continuing moving things over. Okay, so those guys are moved over there. So what we're going to do is uh, we're actually going to go ahead and take this one down. This is going to turn into a garden. And it's also going to turn into a good garden. So we're going to put that there. And these guys, uh, let's see, rock. So we need heartbeats for those. I'm going to go ahead and we're going to have to go out and find a heartbeat. I, of course, I don't have any. So let's go grab, let's go grab a heartbeat. And get that in there. And then we're going to take care of those. Um, this garden. Is this garden fully upgraded? Garden fully upgraded. Okay. This garden is not fully upgraded. So get that garden fully upgraded as well. And then let's see. I want to make sure that these all have uh, music. Collectors and feeders. And we're going to try to stay on top. of. The oh, shoot. All the chickens. I forgot about all the chickens. Um, I'm going to throw all the chickens in here. I'd say we have quite a few chickens in there, <laughs> uh, but I don't think the chickens are actually going to stay there. So funny enough. Okay. So where might I find a heartbeat? Let's see. I didn't see any rock slimes until, you know, let's go over in the, let's go into the, let's take the portal. Let's go into that area. We also need to get another portal up, but you know, one thing at a time here, we'll take this guy and see if we can find any heartbeats over here. I feel like, so there's rock slimes. Might there be a heartbeat in here somewhere? They might also be over in this area. Oh, look, it's a golden slime. Did you just eat that golden plort? Oh, thank you. I'll take that. <laughs> I was like staring at, oh, here we go. Perfect, okay. I needed those heartbeats. I was actually looking to see if I could find some, um, if I can find a odd onion while I was over here, but you know, what? we're not going to use audio on odd onions for anything anyways. So I'm not super worried about it, but I will go and grab this silky sand. We always need that silky sand. So, oh, hello. Oh, we've already been down there. Okay. So I've got those. Let's go ahead. Let's head back. Actually, let's check in here for strange diamonds. Any strange diamonds? Uh... There's something. We got this guy. Might as well grab it. 
All right, looks good. I don't really see anything. So let's head back. Okay, so we got the heartbeat, which is good. That is exactly what we need for these guys. So that crosses that off. Let's go ahead and let's sleep for the night. We'll come back and we'll do some more rearrangements here. All right, are you, do you guys have a food thing? You don't have the air box or the, that. You needed that, you need this as well. Let's go ahead and let's get your food out. Well, these guys need some upgrades too. All right. So these guys are gonna be good here. Now, what we're gonna do is I'm actually gonna go ahead and put in a, um, a pen here for the pink slimes because we're gonna need a lot of pink slimes here so the idea behind the pink slimes let's go ahead and grab all of these out of here and that out of there um the idea behind the pink we're gonna go ahead and just destroy this as well okay and then a corral high walls yes yes don't need that yes and yes okay the idea behind the uh, the pink slimes is going to be because one one we need pink slimes for like a lot of stuff and two we're just going to feed them the extra food that we have from all these guys because we're eventually with the, with the gardens upgrade and stuff we're gonna have a we're gonna have food issues so uh, we're gonna leave that to do its thing there so this area looks like it's pretty much good to go um i don't know what i should do should we just go ahead and upgrade the chickens i guess i mean i you know i don't know there goes all the um all the elder chickens huh i feel like we have too many chickens in here <laughs> like i feel like we need some mass chicken storage if you know what i'm saying um okay that works good there let's go down here and check these out i'm pretty sure these these two are pretty much good to go except we need some upgrades on here so let me go ahead and grab the cube berries for these guys. Just gonna, we're just gonna kind of go through and make sure everything's upgraded as much as it can be. Everything's good. That way we can get the plorts that we need, get the money that we need, and uh, kind of stay on top of things. Let's see, do you have? You don't have a lot of stuff. You're missing. You're missing some things as well. And I'm always setting these to lowest speed because I think the lowest speed is probably gonna be fast enough. And then you can collect. I've got this extra storage thing here or this extra corral. You know what I'm thinking? I'm thinking chicken overflow. <laughs> that is exactly what I'm thinking. Chicken overflow in that pen right there. And then let's see, you probably don't have a feeder. You probably don't have any of this stuff, right? Music box and a feeder. Let's go ahead and get you fed up and ready. Okay, that looks good. Yeah, we'll go ahead and do chickens in here. We'll do excess chickens in there. Uh, wait a second. What's down here? I've gone down here before, right? I'm almost positive I have. Oh yeah, it's our nice little nice little beach area. It's like oh, weird. It's like nothing out here. Okay, enough of that. Let's get back in here because we've got, um, this area was pretty much already good to go, which is good, but also not super great. Um, I am missing, I would love to get the refinery link and the, um, the market link. I haven't found those yet. Let me know if you have, have you found the, the market link of the refinery link yet? I'm curious if that's like a still thing in the game. Um, I'm going to go ahead we're going to throw the, we're going to throw the gold port. Oh, we do need a storage silo somewhere though. Oh, uh, you know what? Let's throw, actually, hold on. Let me look at the map here. So I've got those two done, those two done, those four done. I've got a pen there, a pen there, food there, food there. We have an extra pen there. We could throw a storage silo in there. Um, I don't really have anything here and I don't really have anything here. If the chickens weren't in here, then we could put a storage silo in here and have like everything stored but we don't really need it. you know what let's utilize this one right here this one seems to be like the closest one um i think i already have my ringtails in there if i'm not mistaken which is going to be kind of a pain to do right now because they're going to be all they're going to be all statuified and stuff <laughs>
Um, and then we have carrots. We have our fire slimes. That there. Oh my goodness. You know what? We have ringtails already. We already have ringtails. So do I really need those ringtails there? Not really. Um, let's see. I could spend 425 new bucks, shade them, and get, you know what? I'm going to do it. We're going to do that. That's going to cause them all to turn into regular dudes. And then I'm going to suck you all up and I'm going to get rid of you because I don't really need you. Okay, so storage silo is in here. Let's go ahead and throw our gold plorts in there. And then let's also throw these, these moon dew nectars because I don't really have anything to do with those. Um, I need to get... These guys are looking pretty good. And actually what I want to do, check this out, is we are going to go ahead and we're going to get another incinerator in here. And we're going to get an ash trough for it as well. Because I'm going to double up on our fire slimes. Because why not? That one's already full. That should be full as well. Okay, so that looks good. And then down here, we actually have some puddle slimes. But much like the other uh the, much like the fire slimes we're gonna go ahead and double up our puddle slimes we got some in there so let's go ahead and add a pond right there and then we can't do anything else with it so puddle pond there they're still in here but i want to go ahead and have a few ponds in here Okay, so we've got two ponds, so we'll go out, we'll grab a bunch of puddle plorts, or puddle slimes, we'll go ahead and grab a, um, actually, you know what, let's do this as well. Should I throw, let's throw a silo here for extra puddle plorts if we don't need them. Throw another pond here. And that is looking pretty good. We already, we've already got a silo in this area. We're probably going to need to go ahead and upgrade it a little bit because I think this is going to be my main silo that I use for probably more more things than not. So actually, there we go. Well, shoot, let's just do one more upgrade. All right, it's fully upgraded. Look at that massive silo ready for storing all of the things. Now, I need to go and grab... Oh, did you guys eat all those heartbeats already? Holy moly. Okay, so those guys are good. Those guys are good. These guys are good. Let's go ahead and drop this stuff into the science area. And let me make sure I don't have those market links. I don't have Taming Bell, Warp Tech. I mean, we have these, these blue warp depots. Set up two gadgets that allow you to remotely transfer resources between two points. Like, those are cool and all, but I. Uh, oh, refinery link. Oh my gosh. We had the refinery link the entire time. Hmm. I want the market link too, though. <laughs> I definitely want the market link. Okay. So that looks good. So let's go out and let's grab a bunch of fire and puddle and pink slimes. Let's go grab those slimes and get those added to our, our farm, if you will. It's a farm. <laughs> it's a farm. And uh, yeah, just we're gonna. I don't. You know what? We're probably gonna have a, quite a few pink slimes. We'll have a ball pit. We'll make a ball pit of pink slimes. What do you think? Okay, so we've got twenty-eight pink slimes already. That's super easy. Uh, I wanted to take the teleporter over to um, to get the fire slimes, <laughs> and then we'll have to go and get um, some puddle slimes. Puddle slimes are. I kind of remember where the puddle slimes are. Ooh, you know what we probably really should build here is we probably should build a, um, a, a tar cannon because we do have quite a few different slimes in here. Probably should go ahead and build one of those for our cells around our base before we uh, do anything else. Let's see. I wanted this double hydro cannon. I need four puddle ports. That's it. We got that. No problemo. Oh, you know what else I just thought of is uh, with the ponds, I think we're going to have to refill them occasionally so we might end up not using the ponds and just using the natural ones but that's fine <laughs> we'll figure that out later i got my six puddle ports which is good so we're gonna set up a um a hydro turret cannon thing in the main area i'm not worried about the chickens i'm worried about all my other slimes 
And I want to make sure that they're going to be nice and safe. All right, so hydro turret. I'm actually really excited to see this one because I don't think I've ever seen a double hydro turret, the, the high powered one. Um, so let's put this right. Okay, so the odds of a slime becoming a tar over here, not so great. Over here, not so great. It's it's probably like these two right here. So let's put it. Let's put it right here. My gosh, we've done it. All right, now I don't think I need to do anything with these guys, right? I think they're pretty sure they're good to go. Yeah, I like that. See, I want to put these like everywhere. I think that'd be kind of fun. All right, so now I need fire. Let's go grab some fire slimes. Those aren't going to be terrible to get at all. Let's see. Fire slimes over here. All right, little fiery buddies. Where are you at? Let's see. Last time I think I saw them down in here. You're not fire slimes. You're a fire slime. You're a fire slime. I'll take you. Any other little fiery boys anywhere? Oh. Oh, that's a boom you go back in the lava have fun in the lava all right no now here <laughs> the fire slimes and the puddle slimes they're just so they're just so darn cute they really are all right let's see fire slimes fire slimes you anything yes Oh no, whatever will I do? There are so many tars here. They are so scary. You know, I've never really had an issue with the tars. I don't feel like I ever have because I mean, they're fairly easy to deal with. They're not like hard to deal with. It just seems like they are absolutely everywhere though. <laughs> Get out of here. Get out of here. Bad tars. Bad tars, get out of here. Trying to find my trying to find my fire slimes and your jerks are just everywhere. Those are boom slimes. Fire slimes. Yay. Okay. Got two more. Oh. Two more. Any more? Let's go up here. Yeah. Alright, so I've got eight. That's not bad. That'll probably work. That'll work good enough. Um, it's a lot of uh, lava dust here. Ooh, primordy oil. We need that. All right. So one, two, three, four, five, six. How many do we have in here? We have seven, six and seven. That'll be fine. Ta-da! You guys are all so happy. Oh my gosh, this chicken just became a meal for them. It was fried chicken, okay? I'm sorry. What, fire slimes don't deserve a delicious meal? I think they do. And instead of cooked carrots they're all the time, maybe they, maybe they want a hearty chicken meal, you know? You really, really never know. Um, also, this is another reason that we have those pink slimes is because like, look at all these carrots I have. So many carrots. So we should be able to uh, get so many pink ports going out of these guys like no problem too. Maybe I should have put them back there. Hmm. 
carrots are like just so many so there's um there's definitely some slimes that i'm missing here i miss my quantum slimes i really do i miss the quantum slimes i miss the um um i'm glad we have the honey slimes like for sure but i do miss the mosaics i really like the mosaic slimes they're they're really uh quite adorable and they're just not here they're just not here so okay that all looks good everything looks pretty good right now we need to go get puddle slimes but we're gonna have to go back into this area and i need to get into this area right here and get the puddle slimes because that's where they're at so let's go ahead let's sleep for the night we'll go grab some puddle slimes first thing in the morning uh do we have any messages not yet let's see let's go ahead and i guess let's get everybody fed topped off here and then we'll go grab some puddle ports all right puddle slimes you are what we're searching for today and i think you're gonna be easy because i think they're gonna be right in here oh puddle slimes where are you at really no puddle slimes in this area already hmm that's not great is there puddle slimes down in here is there any water sources down in here not really oh darn uh any puddle slimes guys puddle slimes anywhere has anybody seen a puddle slime wow i'm actually you know i'm actually kind of surprised like i thought the puddle slimes would be super easy to find okay i walked this whole river there's no puddle slimes here either i don't know where the heck are they at all right you puddly buddies where are you at there's one you get your little puddly butt over here okay uh what's down here is there super secret secrets down here <gasps> what's this this is a super secrety secret all right here we go come on upgrade something good let's go what do we got happy statue oh my gosh there are no sad statues only happy little statues um okay wow that was that was definitely a hidden spot right there oh tars oh my gosh that was right there okay well now i know where it was okay so nothing here we've got one puddle for one one additional one. Oh. one additional one is uh, is a little bit less than what i was originally looking for about down in here hey puddle buddy another puddle buddy another puddle buddy any more puddle buddies I mean, we got four that is something oh an odd onion too perfect trying to get trying to have like a collection of everything here let's go and grab these two because i don't know if we're ever gonna have like a bounty board like we did in the first slime rancher but if we do i want to be ready for it you know like, i want to be ready to go okay so we got our puddle slimes let's go and take those back um four more puddle slimes that is not terrible oh my gosh these guys are eating through this ash like so fast yeah this one's completely like gone holy moly you guys need to calm down okay we're gonna go put the puddle ports away now i'm curious to see if the water level has gone down on these ponds I feel as though it has. Okay, so there's those. Let me see if I can fill these back up at all. Uh, let's see. I need this one. Okay, it doesn't look like it's filling up, which is good. Now that might have that might have been an early thing in slime ranch for the first one i don't remember because i didn't really use ponds a whole lot after that um but they would drain the ponds as you went along um and as they made plorts they would drain the ponds so like you had to keep 
refilling the pond that is why the nor like natural bodies of water are super nice because they're like an infinite water source so um that's kind of the deal with those let me grab some of these carrots And we'll go ahead and fill this guy back up. My gosh. Wow, that didn't even fill it up. All right, that filled it up. Okay, so we got 50 fire slimes. Like we are ports. We're, we're, really cooking on the fire fire plates like here holy moly um okay so let's go ahead and we're gonna dump these carrots into the pink slime pit because they're so hungry and wanting needed food and then we're gonna go dump everything into the um into our science deal and i think we've got everything we need so far i feel like we've got all the slimes i think we've got all the slimes and i think we've got plenty of fire slimes plenty of por portal slimes or puddle slimes and uh, I think we're ready. I think we're ready for whatever basically the game has to throw at us next. So next time, I think what we're probably going to end up doing, since we don't have any upgrades right now, is I think we're going to go out and do a little bit of map hunting, exploring. We're going to go out and try to find some pods to open up and some doors to open up. So that's going to be the focus of the next goal. And then after that, I don't know because I feel like we're running a little low here. I feel like we've explored the first uh our first taste of the game pretty good here but i don't know leave a comment down below let me know what you think what do we have left to do what do you want to see and uh we'll get after it but yeah thanks again for coming out have an absolutely fantastic rest of your day and i'll see you next time bye everybody